Welcome to Red Dead 2 and thanks for joining us. Today we are going to learn how to craft the no man's vest. What you're going to need for this of course is $27 and a couple of pelts. Uh, first off you're going to need a perfect panther pelt. And the trick is you got to find one of these things with three stars. There is a spawn point here just east of Catfish Jackson. The problem or the challenge that we have uh, with getting this perfect panther pelt is simply, you know, we're not always going to get that perfect spawn. And we need to have it spawn uh, three stars in order to have a, a good uh, chance. And we're going to need a good shot, of course, too. A couple of ways we can improve our odds, of course, is to... Number one, save your game before you get near the Catfish Jackson area or before you get to the spawn point. And if it doesn't spawn, you can always go back. Now, if that doesn't work, of course, you can always set up camp and go back as well, get a little bit of sleep. Now, the weapon of choice you're going to have to use here, there's a couple different options. I generally prefer the Springfield Rifle. But you can also get the job done with improved arrows, as we will take a look at right here. Now, one other thing, I would highly recommend using Deadeye when dealing with this panther, as it goes at you pretty quickly. If you don't get it, it's going to get you. And of course, like I said earlier, if you do not get that three star panther, you know, you can always load the game that you just saved before you got there and try again you'll have a better chance of getting a respawn, of course. This one is, you know, a little bit tricky, but uh, as you can see, we get the job done here, looking at the replay. It's uh, it's, it's quick. you got you got to be quick. If you get quick, you can get the job done. And, of course, you want to skin this thing and uh, make sure you take the actual pelt to a trapper so you can sell it there. Now let's go ahead and shift gears and focus on the other item we need. And that, of course, is the perfect goat hide. And for this, you can go to any ranch. We are going to be going to the Emerald Ranch to get our goat hide. And, of course, we are going to be armed with the Springfield Rifle. And, of course, we're looking for one that has three stars. And we'll take our shot there. Or you're going to use Deadeye. You don't have to use Deadeye for this thing. Uh, but the important part is, you know, you want to find one that has three stars and get a good good shot off. Of course, uh, target areas around here. And we'll take a look at the replay in slow motion. One thing I would like to point out here is you want to try to be sneaky, get in around nighttime or so. Not always going to work that way. Odds are, if you get one of these goats... You're going to uh, have a little problem with some witnesses. Now you could try to escalate or silence a witness, but that usually creates more problems for you. So your best option is just to get on your horse and get out of there. Watch the wanted meter slowly, slowly drain. And of course, pay the small penalty the next time you go to... Uh, railroad station or whatever just pay that five dollar penalty don't let things escalate too much and of course once we've got both these items set up you're going to probably want to save your game just in case something happens so that you have the pelt pelts saved uh, if something does happen and you haven't saved your game and you haven't sold the pelts well you're going to be in a little bit of trouble so just save your game that's uh, the recommendation here now there are five different trapper locations that you can take one of these these pelts to. Which one you choose, of course, is up to you. We are going to go to the one in the blue box that is in Saint Denis, and uh, I assume that you know how to sell these things to a trapper. So what we're going to do is just go ahead and buy. What we're going to do is hold down L2 and then of course hold down the triangle button to select buy. Then we're going to select the first item right there. It's called garments. Hit X. We're going to scroll down to where it says the Wrangler. 
So you're looking for the Wrangler, of course. And you're going to go ahead and hit X on the Wrangler. And then we're looking for, of course, the No Man's Vest. Once we've got that, we'll go ahead and hit X. And that will equip and craft the item. And then, of course, all we need to do is back out by pushing the circle button multiple times. And uh, as you can see, here we have the No Man's Vest. We're wearing it right now. And, uh, yeah, that pretty much wraps this up. I am signing out. Thank you for watching. And good luck.